welcome to a new episode of Resolute Fitness. Today is Monday, just coming into the afternoon here in North Carolina. Um, boiling as, as normal, up to like 97, 98 degrees today. Five of Jason Kleeper's 30 day challenge. Uh, those that are not familiar with this, Jason Kleeper's trying to push himself for 30 days. So each day he's releasing a new workout and giving his score and everything. So I'm gonna put that all down below in the description. We did it on Friday, day four, and then we've had Saturday, Sunday off from Jason's program. I did the bleep test on Saturday. I've done a little video on that. And then Sunday, Sunday was, I did a bit of yoga actually, and, and Emily Emily rested. Okay, so similar to the, the previous videos, he, um, he releases a warm up for the workout, then either a strength or skill portion, and then, um, and then the Metcon workout bit at the end. And I've just been filming the last bit, the Metcon, but for today was was a warm up. Uh, again, I'll put all this in the description. And then it was deadlifts uh, 642, 642 for reps. So yeah, we've done that. Uh, we're on limited equipment at the moment as pretty much everybody else is. So it's just dumbbells, we've got a barbell um, and a wall ball and a keg. So I had to be creative with how we did this. So I just put the fat grips onto the 50 pound dumbbells and I think Emily was, she used a bar and used a keg and dumbbells because the weight's meant to go heavier as the reps decrease. Okay, for the Metcon part, it was five sets of 10 deadlifts, 15 to 12, 15 or 12 calories on the assault bike for males and females. Now, obviously don't have a assault bike, so he puts in his uh, description to you uh, to do burpees, 15 burpees. So that's what me and Emily did. So we did the 10 burpees, uh, we did the 10 deadlifts, and then the 15 burpees. Emily, Emily mixed it up with using using the keg and using using the dumbbells because again each set is meant to get a little bit heavier and that isn't really possible for me for the first round i used the keg which is about 60 pounds so it's just a little bit awkward in the second round i just did the 50 pound dumbbells put the fat grips on those of you that are familiar with the fat grips you'll know why that's made it more difficult uh, those that haven't it just makes your grip like open up and it's more taxing on your wrists and it's just awkward so yeah did tenor then the second round third round what I did was I started to do a complex so I did a, a left deadlift left side deadlift with one dumbbell and then a double dumbbell deadlift so for 10 and then the next round I switched arms went on to the right hand and then the last set was left hand deadlift right hand deadlift and then double deadlift so it was a complex of the three movements for every one rep uh, it made it taxing. I couldn't go, couldn't go unbroken on that, so I was down to singles. So yeah, certainly I managed to do it where it was getting heavy, harder each time, and same, same with Emily. So yeah, I wanted to keep it in spirit of, of what Jason was after with the workout, uh, regardless of not having having any heavier weights really. However you want to do that, if you want to do something similar, or if you just want to use a set weight and just knock them all out, you can do. Uh, the idea of it is it's meant to be a sprint. Oh, it's set by a wash. The idea of it is that it's meant to be sort of a sprint because you're getting one minute and 30 seconds rest after each one. So yeah, just to clarify, five sets, 10 deadlifts, 15 burpees, one minute and 30 seconds rest. Uh, also, tip, the maths starts to get a little bit diff difficult when you're finishing out like three minutes and 14 seconds and stuff like that, and you've got to work out a minute and 30. So, all right, so here's the video in its entirety. Enjoy, enjoy the workout, and we've got another 25 of these to go. Oh.
Okay, thank you for watching guys. I'm still getting attacked by a fucking boss. Alright, thanks for watching. If you can like, subscribe, much appreciated. Uh, if you did the workout, by all means leave a comment below. Let me know how you get on and how you managed to um, mix it up and change it. I'm always open for um, new ideas because for the foreseeable future I won't be going to the to the gym so it's going to be home workouts and just trying to keep creative with the equipment that I've got uh, keep safe keep healthy and yeah let's keep going keep working out and enjoy the rest of the summer right bye bye